Yo, what's up, you lot? So, it is 6 p.m. Let's see what we have for content. And before I do, make sure that you check out the Team Week video that's going to be on my channel later today. Let's have a look. Um, Here we go. Ooh! Oh my god! That's awesome! Ben Bender and Lars Bender. The two brothers. That's sick. Oh, look at the look at the little design on the car. That's so sick, man. That's so awesome. Look at the design on the Oh, you love to see it, man. I know they're both approaching the end of their careers. Well, let me see. Uh let me try to find the ages. Lars Bender. How old is he? Um, it's 31, yeah. They're approaching towards the end, but not yet there. But it's amazing to see, like, the, the artwork and design that went into the... That's so awesome. All right, so let's see what they both cost. 84, 84. I'm hoping they're the same. And I'm pretty sure you can do both of them for your teams. Yeah, they're the same. 84, 84 with Team of the Week. That's around 200k. Uh, get, Probably going to go a lot higher now. Probably, like, 250k because a lot of people are going to be doing these two cards because they're linked together. They're literally linked together. Hyperlink as well. So you've got your defense sorted if you've got these two. Um, wow. Two such good moves. It doesn't matter much for a center back. Medium high defensive. That's pretty good. Four star weak foot as well. Pretty sick to have on a center back. Why not? The agility balance for um for a center back is not bad. 72, 74. Agility balance right there. The defending stats are perfect and the physicals are perfect. If you're asking me to put a camp style on this. I'm actually putting an engine on this, you know, because uh, passing, it could use some improvement. The dribbling could obviously use some improvement, and the pace obviously could use some improvement. But if most people are probably going to go with uh, an anchor or a catalyst, you know, pace and passing. Um, I think catalyst is one of the better ones, to be fair. But it, a lot of different camp styles could work for this one. Injury prone, as usual. Um, let me just show who you, his full stats because my camera's obviously covering somewhere. There are his full stats if you want to have a look. Um, let's go back. Let's check out his brother. Probably the more attractive looking. I don't mean by the face. I mean by the, the stats because he's got a lot of pace. Let's be honest. I think a lot of people rather use this card at center back than um, the other one. I keep confusing them, man. Lars is the right back. Okay. Okay. Um, I'll be completely honest. I would rather use... Lars at center back instead of Sven. I'll be honest. Um, he's got dives and tackles. Obviously injury prone again, but I'd rather use this car at center back than use the other guy at center back. If I'm being completely honest, because the pace is good. The defending and physicals are very good. I'll show you them right here. They're very good still. The dribbling is much, much better. And the passing is also much, much better. Um, and obviously the shooting is much better. It doesn't really matter though. Do Lars avoid Sven. Or do both of them if you want that amazing hyperlink. But yeah, that's just my opinion. I think I'd rather do Lars over Sven because he looks he looks so usable, man. They're the same height, so the height shouldn't matter. The body type shouldn't really matter either. Um work rates don't matter either. They're both medium high um defensive. Um yeah. Two amazing SBCs, man. Um, in reality, coming in at around 250k. Um, I recommend doing both of them if you can. If you can, at least do the right back if you want. Uh, out of 10, I've got to give this a 9. I love the car design with the, 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 like, the, that, yeah, yeah, the, the handshake is awesome, man. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Bender Brothers are in FIFA, both idiot rated. Let me know what you guys think. Like, subscribe. See you guys in a bit.